so I don't know if my phone is gonna fall from like where it is I think it might because it keeps wobbling <laughs> like really bad but I'm on my way to this little Shein pop-up shop that they open here in Miami and I'm like kind of excited about it because like when I order from Shein the shipping always takes so long and like you can't try the stuff on so I've always had to like return stuff I have no idea where I'm going I just realized that because I'm recording this so I don't have my maps on me but I'm really excited for this like little pop-up shop I don't know if it's gonna be like cute so it's like a photo op moment or I don't I have no idea what to expect I, there's no pictures like today is the first day it opens and oh my god that car is going so fast today's like the first day it opens so it opens at 11 and it's 10 30 so I'm almost I'd say like about 15 minutes away so I'm hoping that there's clothes there's clothes like my size when I get there which I'm sure there will be because it's it just opens I don't think that there's gonna be um, like no clothes since it's just the first day so I'm hoping Ooh, my phone is like wobbling I'm hoping to like find something I have no idea where I'm going so I'm gonna be back because I don't know what exit this is off of my phone is gonna fall so it's gonna be like a really bad angle but um, I'm really excited because like I don't know what to expect of this pop-up shop and I don't know like how much clothes they have and Shein is like really cheap <laughs> like phone holder on my car so it's probably gonna fall any second now because it keeps falling so hopefully it stays put I look naked but I promise I'm wearing a shirt but the pop-up shop was super cute like it had a bunch of clothes out the only problem was that you have to go super early because they let people in by like groups and I was actually one of like I was part of like the first group that got into pop-up shop so like everybody by the, the end of the line like by the time they got in the shop there was probably not any good things out because they they when I asked them if they had stuff in the back like that didn't exist it was just what was out so I don't know how the people in the back like were able to get clothes and stuff because like by the time that even I went in and I was part of the first batch like there was just no clothes like in in smalls because it was small medium large sizes only there wasn't really any, any extra smalls but they were just mostly larges by the end of it like by the time I got out I was able to buy stuff that was my size just like there was some pieces that were cute and they had only larges because the first people that went in got the smalls so it was like a little packed and just a little bit crazy I think this pop-up shop is only going for like two days so it ends tomorrow like Sunday and I'll probably film like a little haul like once I actually get home so the camera keeps falling and um honestly I'm, ex I'm expected it because like this makeshift camera holder here that I have is just not working out I had to change the camera angle a little bit because I think this way holds my phone better honestly I just have like my purse on the dashboard and my phone leaning against it so it has like zero support whatsoever but I'll probably film a haul like when I get home like of what I bought and I also went to um, after the pop-up shop I went to like one of my friends house and she lives near the pop-up shop so what we did was like we went to Zara and like Zara is having this huge sale so today was just has been shopping like I've spent too much money and I need to stop but it was just like a nice day overall I didn't film anything like with my friend and like when I went to Zara just because like I'm not too comfortable like filming in public yet I don't even know if this is gonna be posted but if it is hi world I'll probably do a little haul when I get home and show like the pieces I got and stuff and I got these really cute sunglasses oh they're actually right here so I'm gonna try them on but yeah that's it's been an eventful day and I can't even play music in the car as I record this because my phone I'm recording this on my phone because I wasn't really planning on like filming anything today but my phone was like pretty decent quality so hopefully it's not too shitty when I'm editing this but these glasses are just super cute like but I have to wear them like kind of down. If I wear them up, I look too weird. I 
looked like that person from the vine the one that she's like and she like turns around i look too crazy but if i put them down they're like kind of cute and like for a picture you know what i mean but yeah that's how today kind of went i feel like i'm just gonna be talking in like this whole like i don't even know if to call it a vlog or not because like <laughs> is this a vlog is it not i think it could be considered a vlog i just have to like film in public and stuff but i don't know if i'll probably do something tomorrow and film it too like it's probably i have like no footage like i just have to like practice filming in public like i'm just a little scared about doing that like i don't know i'm just i feel like people would look at me weird because not a lot of people do that here in miami like you'd be surprised because it's a big city but um yeah not a lot of people do it so like the public isn't too comfortable with seeing people filming so um i don't know i just keep talking and honestly but yeah that's how today went i'm hoping that tomorrow is like a good day too because today i had like such a good time and i actually like left my house i don't really go out and stuff so it was like pretty fun it was like a nice change so i'm finally home and i think i'm gonna do a little try on haul or just like a regular haul and just show like the pieces that i got at zara and then also the pieces i got at shein um we, I went to Shein first, like I went to the pop-up shop, that was like the whole point of the morning. And then after I met up with my friend, just like I was staying in the car, and we went to Zara because they're having like this huge sale. So I bought like two little things there and I'm just gonna show you guys what I bought. So I'm really hoping that the lighting is not too bad. The bags that this came in, super cute, Oops, wrong way. But it says Shein on it. It kind of reminded me of a Chanel bag, I'm not gonna lie. So um, I don't know if that's what they were going for. The Shein um, pop-up shop was in the design district in Miami. So like that's where all the designer, I don't know why I just did that. Um, that's where like all the designer stores are. So like Chanel, Gucci, Tom Ford, um, Givenchy was there. Like just a, it was, it's just where all those stores are. So I'm first gonna start off with the Shein clothes because that's like what I did this morning. I even got a pair of shoes. Like this store was cheap. I'm even gonna probably mention the prices or just put them like in a text box um, when I'm talking about them just because um, the Shein pop-up shop was so cheap, but these glasses are so cute. And like the only thing is that they make everything super yellow, but honestly, like they're really cute and for pics, they'd probably be really cute too. I also got another pair of glasses, but I don't know if I brought them with me. I tried them on in the car, like when I recorded that little thing in the car, but I also got those glasses and those were only $3. And then I also went and I bought these shoes. I thought they were so cute and they're just really summery and like also just for traveling, I think they're really cute and they probably match with everything super well. They're just black regular sandals and like the front of the shoe is like little bow ties. So I thought they were super cute and they were only $15. I was not able to try anything on in this store, so I have no idea if these are gonna fit me. They're a size six, which is like my number, but usually with shoes, like you never know. I'm really hoping they fit though, cause they're really cute. This is like the last accessory, but it could also be worn too. It's like one of those little bandana cloths. But um, the reason I bought this was because I really wanna put it on like my purse. Usually people just will tie their little scarf around their purse and it makes it so cute or just even like as a belt sometimes you put it through your jeans and it looks so cute and then it just looks like really cute like with your bag kind of thing but also like a lot of people have worn them like on their head or honestly you can wear these like any way you want to i just thought it was so cute and i couldn't like i, I really wanted one of these bandana type things for my purse like i think it's just such a cute like accessory for your purse and it just makes it like look a little bit more i don't know like designer i guess because like a lot of designer bags have these types of scarves on them i got this which is kind of like something i'm wearing right now but it's just like a tube top type material shirt and then the sleeves are also like scrunched in the beginning and then they kind of go flowier so it looks super summery and then some of the clothes had like pictures on them like of people wearing it but um honestly i just have to try them on like i think it's really cute it's very summery i mean in miami it's always summer so like all of these pieces i'm probably going to be able to wear like year round then i also got this it's like a bodysuit it's like see-through i don't know how to properly show it but like if you kind of see like up close it has like little specks of glitter and i thought it was so cute for like going out at night 
and just pairing them with like jeans and then you just put like a like a bralette or like some type of like bra under and it looks super cute i know a lot of people that have been wearing this and i actually have a bodysuit from shein that i bought online but it's stars so i thought this one was super cute and it's like a little bit different and i just love like this whole like see-through mesh um trend going on the next thing i got was actually just a plain t-shirt because it's like just a white plain cropped t-shirt because i always wear these types of shirts with like jeans and i have one in black actually but since i wear the black one so much i needed one in white so i saw it and i was like i have to and luckily i was able to get one in a small because like a lot of the smalls had run out because i wasn't the first in line so everybody who was first in line just i think grabbed every small possible so the last thing i bought from there is actually this skirt it's like a cheetah skirt right but i was thinking with like a white tube top it would probably look so cute and like i'm not really a skirt person like i am like i have a pair, i have one jean skirt but never like designs like this and i'm really hoping that i like it on because if i don't um i can't return it so that was it for the Shein um, clothes that I bought. But then we also went to Zara and I only bought two things at Zara because I wasn't really planning on like going crazy. I got this super cute, it's like a black sweater, right? And I don't have any plain black sweaters because the only black sweat, actually the only sweaters I own are merch sweaters. So like they have Ariana Grande on it or like Harry Styles or they just have like a bunch of shit on it. And this one, is plain and i actually really needed a plain sweater and it's really nice on the inside and it was really cheap it was only seven dollars so i was like i'm definitely buying that so this one's more of like a the material is like a lot more fancier this is something a little bit different than what i normally wear but i saw a girl wearing like jean shorts like high-waisted and a material shirt like this and it looked so cute it looks like fancy casual and i think it's so cute so i love the pattern on it i love the color blue i think it's super cute it kind of looks like a boy shirt but i promise like on it looks cute um and yeah i don't know if i'm gonna be finishing this like vlog thing here or if i'm gonna record something i do later on or if i'm gonna do something tomorrow so if i don't do anything tomorrow i'll probably just post this and like see how this is gonna turn out because this is like my first type of vlog thing um i've always kind of wanted to like start a youtube channel kind of thing but i've been scared and nervous to do so but i think i'm just gonna do it for myself and like i like talking a lot so i think this is gonna be fun um i hope you guys enjoyed this video whoever watched it hi welcome to my channel that i'm gonna start now i hope to continue it and yeah bye